Hey guys, welcome to Brian's Man Cave. So today I'm going to be playing some Laser Blast. Um, and the reason why I chose this game was because I was just doing my awesome games from A to Z and I was I was looking at Laser Blast thinking I haven't really played this game in a long time. I don't think I played it very much. So here's a chance for me to actually give it a real good try. Um, I'm going to start off on just the first level, the basic. It looks like there's four settings, so it's probably like, you know, easy to hard so let's just uh let's just give this a shot i hit the reset button i think that's me up there on that little um flying saucery thing and uh i mean the object of this game really is just to uh blow up those things down there before they blow up you so it kind of like almost reminds you of uh like missile command but it's kind of the opposite direction, like, whoa, in that you're trying to blow up the three stations, not try and keep them alive. That's cool, too. Like, when you get hit, they, like, they're obviously shooting those blue lasers. Ah, and I can still steer when I'm crashing, which is cool, because that means I can actually take them out, um, even though I'm, I'm about to be taken out myself. I can kind of take them with me. It's like, if I'm going out, you're going out with me. Almost like a kamikaze mission at that point. But I guess, you know, you're going to crash anyway, so... Might as well take them down with you. So this is on the first, uh, first setting, and, uh... Just seems like, you know... I'm just hitting... Things that aren't even shooting back right now. It's like I got a free man, oh, that's cool. Now obviously you can't, uh, this isn't like, you know, some of those other space shooters, like, where you can just keep shooting. You're, you're kind of, you gotta get strategic with this laser beam. And, uh, almost like be on point with what, what you want to hit. Whoa. Ugh. Well, I mean, overall the graphics are pretty neat. Um, it's Activision, so they, they are pretty good at what they, what they were doing back then, and... Uh, like this one, obviously, it's it, there's nothing extra special about the graphics. Whoa. You, um, you know, it, it just gives you what it needs to play the game. I felt the, the background could have been a little bit prettier. But, uh, you know, maybe they could have put some stars or something in there. Or, I don't know, some kind of graphic. I know I've said that before on some of the other uh, Atari games that I've played, but, you know, you can't expect too much. I know, I understand that, but... Um, let's, uh, let's try one of the other settings. Uh, so this is going to be two. Let's give two a shot. See if there's anything different. Or if it's just going to be, you know, harder. So it looks like, whoa. So it looks like in two I can actually go down now. I don't think I was able to do that in the first setting. I think I was just able to go left and right. Um, I don't know if that's really going to be handy. I mean, you're still within their range, right? And that, that missile still goes up all the way up to the screen, so... I mean, going lower doesn't seem to be any any much different. Maybe because you're closer to it, the aiming's a little bit easier? Whoa. It's really, yeah, I mean, the game doesn't really change much beyond this point. It's really just target practice, trying not to get killed. I guess for the strat, whoa, for the strategy, you kind of want to wait till it fires and then go after it. That way you don't go go over top of the thing when it's ready to shoot. He's got to be quick. Got to be ready for the, ready for it. The other thing is, I find that shooting downwards obviously a lot easier than trying to shoot on the angle. Because you have to be, like, exact on your angle. But sometimes you're not going to be able to do that, so you're going to have to kind of move over and do that kind of side shot. I feel it's starting to get faster. Oh, I think I just got a free man. Whoa! But yeah, this is really just a points game. I mean, this is 
how far can you get or you know with points um, because it's not there's no real other objective to the game you're not going to complete it like there's no like end goal here it's just trying to stay alive let's see if I try three let's see if, what's different it's probably just gonna be a little bit faster you know the targets are moving they're shooting probably gonna shoot a lot more whoa I'm gonna take them out on the way down that is cool that they made that option though I mean you would think that you know if you got hit you would just fall straight down but uh, I guess it's kind of like if you're in an airplane and you, they shoot shoot at you and you're going down you can still somewhat guide the plane in a certain direction almost like the kamikaze fighters who would just fly into something like if you know you're going down you know you're gonna die you might as well uh, fly yourself into the uh, enemy so let's go to four let's see how crazy this is imagine what four is like whoa crazy okay you can do it you can do it there we go okay now it's getting nuts take him out take him out ah, I missed him and landed right in front of him oh and I just started and I got blown out Jeez. Okay. Oh. Wow. That was crazy. Let's try it again. You want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. As Bruce Wayne once said. Oh. Take him out. Wee. Yeah, this is this just gets crazy. Like they just start shooting. Their aim is a lot more accurate than mine. That's for sure. Do the four again. Ah. Whoa, whoa! Holy crap! He wouldn't stop shooting. This is like getting impossible. How? How do you do this? Yeah, it's, it's level level four gets really intense. I'll just stand here, right out of their view. Ah, that was working for a little bit there. It's like I had that sweet sweet spot where they weren't hitting me. Oh no. One more life. You can do it. Oh no. Oh, I think I just got a free man. And I just lost the free man. Oh, that was fun. Not even a game over screen. You know, they they really kept this game pretty simple. <laughs> there's not a there's no opening screen, there's no dead screen there's no end screen no nothing but overall I mean still kind of fun I could see you kind of getting into this especially with your friends and trying to rack up that score obviously playing on uh, four was kind of hard I mean those those after the first wave they just were shooting every second and it was like how do you move when this with the stream is just all the way across the screen you can't even go through it I don't know a little bit of a crazy game anyways that was laser blast on the Atari 2600 by Activision. Not a bad game. I mean, I picked it up for 50 cents. I can't complain. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Let me know what you think of the game. Have you played it? Do you like it? Which ones do you prefer out of the Activision titles? And uh, yeah, throw it down in the comments below. Anyways, hope you subscribe to my channel. Talk to you later.